picketing against corruption. The DA promised voters it will ensure good governance with ethical leadership, not just in Nelson Mandela Bay, but the entire Eastern Cape. We're sending out a very strong message today that this city is going to be the bastion of anti-corruption and good governance. And we're going to use this as a beacon of hope for the Eastern Cape to show people that where you have a good governance that, that delivers services, that doesn't steal the money, things get done for people in that particular municipality. And we want it to spread like a contagion from Nelson Mandela Bay and Kucha municipality all the way out to the Eastern Cape to be able to liberate people from corrupt administrations. DA mayoral candidate for the Nelson Mandela Bay, Naba Banga, says the party has already shown that it's serious about fighting corruption. It's not only in the office of the Premier the problem. The problem we have in the Eastern Cape is that all our municipalities are, coll are collapsing because of mismanagement of uh, municipal coffers. Therefore, we are saying it's only the DA that gets things done by putting up consequences for people who take wrong decisions uh, in these councils. And that's what we are saying as a DA. And in this Nelson Mandela municipality, I have shown it that there is consequence for people who have taken wrong decisions and also who have stolen money from the city. The DA is in power in the metro through a collision with the UDM, COPE, the AIC and the ACDP. Lerato Fekisi, SABC News, Kabeja.